Hi everyone, it's Sue from Sue's Puzzles and today we're going to be doing my November puzzle haul. I do have quite a few video or puzzles to get through this month because I just got really lucky and when I went to the resale, there was just like somebody's whole collection twice. I went twice puzzle shopping this month and both times I ran into at least like 10 puzzles at one place and they were donated by the same person. I could tell by the way the boxes were taped. So there's going to be a lot of puzzles. So I'm going to flip through them rather quickly in the video. But like always, at the end, I will be doing a slower flip through of a closer up of each puzzle so that you guys can see it if you care to. Now, the only puzzle I got this month that I bought brand new from the store was this Cloudberry gradient puzzle. Someone asked me to do a review of Cloudberries, and so I've been wanting to get this. It's been in my cart on Amazon for forever, so I actually bought it so I could do the review. So this will be coming up soon. All the other puzzles that I purchased this month were from Goodwill or Deseret Industries, which is a local resale shop here in the state of Utah. I did not pay more than $3 for any one of these puzzles I got. And a lot of them looked brand new, like they were only used one time by somebody and donated. And I did find three puzzles that were still sealed that nobody had even put together. So let's get to the video. I'll show you everything that I got and then do a slow flip through at the end if you care to see a closer up picture. So thanks for watching. If you're not a subscriber, I would love to have you. And on to the puzzles. So the first puzzles I'm going to show you are these Raven's Burgers. Now this one I got for my grandkids, obviously. It's a Toy Story. Three puzzles for um, 49 pieces each. And then I also found this Monsters University, which I thought was really cute. That's three puzzles, 49 pieces each. And then this one I got from my granddaughter too. It's 300 pieces. I might do this one before I send it off. And then another one for my granddaughter with the Disney princesses. And this is just a 200 piece puzzle. It's got the three Disney princesses on there. I thought that was really cute. And then one Ravensburger for me, which is a Christmas theme one. Let's see if I can. It's got Santa in the middle of the tree. And this one is a Christmas limited edition. I wish I could find the name. Santa's Christmas Wonderland. That's what that one's called. And then I found this really cute Amy Stewart. This one is by Seiko. Oh, it's, can you find the objects? It's got different ones listed like a green apple, vanilla extract, and all that. Well, there it is. It's probably something kitchen. I've got like a cute kitchen or something like that in a different one. And I got this bits and pieces called Little Ballerina. And then I found these three puzzles, which are brand new. Never been even opened. 
This is called Sweet Shop for Kittens. And it's by Buffalo Games. Now I got a few more of this artist I'll show you later, but this is a brand new one. This is called Northern Tra Tranquility by Kim Norlin. This is a Buffalo Game thousand piece puzzle. It's got some ducks by a lakeside cabin. And then this Ravensburger was also brand new, still sealed. And this is called Colorful Marina. Okay, and then I found this 500 piece puzzle. And this is by Gallison. This is called Florette. And then this one, I believe is by, oh, it's by Lang. It's called Boundary Waters. This is a Buffalo Games, and this is called Color Challenge. It's from the Vivid Collection. It's just a gradient. I love any gradients, so this was right up my alley. This one, I believe, is, yep, this one's brand new, too. This is by Buffalo Games. Signature Collection, Matte Finish Puzzle, it's of the Eiffel Tower, but I don't know what it's called. It doesn't say anywhere that I see it, but I thought that was really pretty. And then I got a ton of Lysaki puzzles. See this whole stack? Somebody must have just donated their whole collection and I just happened upon them. This one is called uh, Trick or Treat Hotel. I got this right after Halloween, so I'm sure somebody just did it and then donated it. This is called Noah and Friends. This is called Hickory Haven Canal. Where the boys are. Proud Little Angler. And the last one, Timberline Jacks. Now oh, I got a whole nother stack. Okay, so somebody must have just donated their whole collection of stuff. And I got like, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, eight, nine, ten puzzles. And they're all the artists I just happened to love and collect. So I bought every single one they had there. And they were all taped shut the same way with like a brown packing tape. So I know it had to be just one person. So this is called Early to Rise by Daryl Bush. I love him. I got a whole bunch by him. And this is Harvest Time. And then 
eagle eye view. I just love the little owl up there. And then the last one of him is Moon Nut, Moonlight Lodge. And then I got some of these Chuck Pinson. I just love his stuff too. Love on the Beach, this is called. Got Inspirations of Spring. And then a couple of those Kim Norlean again. This is called Freedom's Promise. Country Music by the same artist. These are Buffalo Games. And then these are Terry Ridlin, Thousand Piece Puzzle. This one's called Summertime. And this one's called Always Alert by the same guy. Isn't that just beautiful? And then, of course, I got a few Dowdle puzzles because those are my favorite. This is Marble Head. I'm not sure if these are just older boxes or what. This one says Gingerbread House Foundation. So maybe a different company made them. I don't know. It says Dowdle Folk Art on the side though. And I got Utah's Dixie. It's a 500 piece. And then I picked up this. I think this is one of those limited edition. This is Intermountain Alta View Hospital. It's a hospital here by where I live. That's it for the dowdles that I got. Okay, then I got this cat one. This is called Captain Nelson. And this is by FX Schmidt. And then I got two by Suns Out. Both 550 pieces. This is called Jungle Gym. I just thought that was cute with all the frogs. And then this one's called Buttercup 2. It's just a kitten. And that's it for all the puzzles. So that's it for the puzzles this month. Of course, I'll be having another puzzle haul next month, like I always do. Um, if you're not a subscriber, I would love to have you. Thanks for watching, and the flip through is coming up after this. Talk to y'all later. Bye. I did a lot of bad things, and never did I give. Cause the thought of being vulnerable Made me feel less than I am I have never felt home Till you entered my door And from that moment I knew That a home is whatever you
Take